Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm excited because I got my box in from Sporties. If you don't know what Sporties is, it's a flying or a pilot's company so you can buy like all of your accessories, hats, um, watches, um, sunglasses, shirts, and anything for flying. It's, it's super cool. So I'm going to show you what I got. I've not even opened it yet. If you know what this is, you know these are the Dave Clark Aviation headset. I'm super excited. Um, I'm just barely thinking to open it. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. Okay, so when I open the box, this is what's in it. Hang on just a second. Okay, I'm back. Okay, so we have this. It comes in this case. Super excited. It's you. Okay. So let me figure out how to get into this thing. It looks like it's got some pockets on this holder. So let's open it up. Ooh, let's see. So it comes on plastic cover. Okay, so let me explain why I ordered this set. I ordered this set because it's the upgraded set and it's Bluetooth, so I can hook it up to my phone and I can listen to music while I fly once I'm solo. The next thing is, is the super comfy ears. It's a foam ear, so it cups around the ear, so it really cuts out the noise. So they're really, really noise canceling. Um, I did a lot of research on these before I actually picked the one I wanted to use or buy. And the reviews on the David Clark are just insane. So I went through a couple different ones and I tossed the idea around of if I wanted to spend the money on the DC-1X. It was kind of crazy. They're, they're expensive. But the quality of them, I don't think you can beat it. Like the ears, the, the padding for the head, like everything about it is just super nice and just super comfortable and I'm so excited about this. Um, I've been waiting for a while. Man, since I've been started this back in August. I don't even know when I started this whole thing, but I, I knew I wanted a headset and the reason why is when you're in a student plane, you have all these people coming through this plane. So everyone, everyone, Nah, I like it this way. Switch sides because it plugs on this side. Everyone has the headset on and they're super close. So your mouth is almost touching the speaker and, and spit and slobber and then with the whole COVID thing, you know, it's kind of like, okay, I would like my own. But the price, like I said, is pretty, it's pretty pricey, but it's worth it. Worth it to have your own, and it's worth it to spend the money for a good one, not a bad one. You want a good one. So, I'm excited about this. I'm going to put in the batteries, I think, if I can figure out how to put in the batteries. Oh, that's it. Okay. So what is that? Alright, so I just figured out something new and cool about this. It comes with a clip. So in any plane, I can clip my adapter to the cover. I'm really stoked about this. Like, I'm really stoked. You can't tell I'm really excited. I'm like super pumped. I've never been so excited about something other than like the first time ever flying. Like this is exciting to me. So the next thing um, is, I saw, I noticed it comes with a clip. So you can clip it on the side because you'll have a little pocket down to, well, it depends on w which seat you're in. 
the actual pilot seat is on the, I want to say left side. So that's where all the controls are. Passenger is on the right. So, like a car. Yeah, like a car. So you have a little clip, so you can clip it onto the bag so it stays out of your way. Probably did that. No, I did that the right way. Wrong way. Wrong way. Anyways, so you can clip it on there. It stays out of your way, but you still have access to it. So you have your power button, you have your left ear up and down, your right ear up and down, and your Bluetooth, which I will connect mine tomorrow because I actually fly tomorrow to another airport. We're going to practice working on my landing. I'm not doing so good on landing. But I will get there. It's a little nerve-wracking when you know you're in this giant aircraft that as soon as you hit the ground, you could possibly die. That's a little nerve-wracking, but I'll get there because I'm doing really good. I'll actually um, had a friend that was watching me fly today uh, actually videotaped me landing. So I am going to actually insert that in here. But I just wanted to do a review on these. I'm super excited. I hope you guys... If you're thinking about flying or you're starting the process of flying, really look into what you want as far as um, aviators. Um, it's just incredible of how, you know, and the people there are so sweet. And David Clark, to me, I have two other um, headsets. I have two other headsets. They are not the um the dc1x they are for like helicopters and other stuff so i have it so when i go to do my rotary license i do have my own set that i can use and i don't have to buy another set so i am excited about that and i am pumped and putting it on i mean they are comfortable i'm really excited and i can't wait to use it it's just it gets me pumped so I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, if you have any questions, please um, comment down below. I'd be willing to answer anything. Um, this was kind of a last second video because this came in and I wasn't expecting it to. But I would like to get more into posting and recording. And um, I said in my last video that I was going to be recording um, the flight process. I think I'm going to wait till I'm solo. Um, and the reason for that is um, there's a lot of communication going on when it's me and the instructor. And I panic. So with the without the stress of it, I don't think I'm going to fly until I am solo. But I will keep you guys up to date and I will give you guys great tips and great advice on it. Um, I'm not too far off from my solo. I'm actually right around the corner from my solo. Landing the plane is really the only thing I have left to do before my solo. And I'm working on that now. Um, because I fly to another airport tomorrow. So that's exciting and new. But I'm just pumped. And if you are a new flyer out there. If you are a new flyer out there. You know really push your mind to it. Find a way to relax. Find your happy place before you do something that's nerve wracking. You won't regret it. It is an amazing feeling. And. I wish everyone the best in it, and I think it's something that everyone should try at least once. Again, buy your own ears, because like I said, germs and everything else in the world right now, just spend the money, buy the ears, they're yours, you don't turn them in, you don't do anything, you don't give them back when you're done, they're yours. So when you decide to rent a plane, buy a plane, whatever, you have your ears. You can buy others for everybody else or just take the ones that come with it. But you have your set. The pilot has their set. Um, I hope you guys have a great rest of your week. And I will hopefully be posting again here soon. Alright, bye guys.